guys, it's Beverly. I got my big D shirt on for Detroit. Detroit Tigers. As you guys know, I was originally from Michigan. So anyway, so day 10 of Vlogmas. This is how the square came out with the elderberry color. It is the same pattern as we used for day one. And I didn't measure to see how close I came. But I think I did pretty good. Did pretty good on the sizes. I'm not going to really worry about it blocking them. Um, she said, I don't have a pattern in front of me. I think she said 17 centimeters. So this is 17 centimeters. Yeah. I'm good. I think I'm good. <clears throat> Excuse me. I just had lunch. Um, and with some ice cream. So that's what's in my throat. But I'm doing good on my 17 centimeters. I know that I've heard of other people that are not. But that's good enough for me. So let's measure another one. I got them out of order now. I have to put them back in order. Yeah, this one is closer to 19, but I don't really care. <laughs> I'm not going to block them. I think they're close enough. Let's measure another one. Yeah, 19. Mine are close to 19 centimeters. So, that's fine. So, I got... 10 squares, 9 squares, 3, 9 squares. So I bet you what's going to happen now is we're going to be going in this blue family, which is probably going to have some green or something in it. So anyway, okay, I, I feel a sneeze coming on. So, And my tape measure on the floor. Okay, so day 10 was some candles. And in the box is a real pretty yarn, Sugar Mouse. We had this color last year, Sugar Mouse. So, those two colors go good. And, ooh, inside the box is a mini pom-pom maker. Mini, mini, tiny small pom-pom maker and see now i put it together and i can there's probably a release but i don't care oh there it is um i'll be probably passing this on to one of my friends in the crochet club because she makes all my pom-poms uh i sold three hats with her pom-poms on them and then i donated a hat that had her pom-pom that she made on it so that's really cool so that'll be for square number 10. And I got these out of order, so I'm going to have to put them in order again, probably. And the color is Sugar Mouse. And we're probably going to use the re some of the yarn that I had left over from that to go with this, or vice versa. Now, this is the Hobby Lobby Day 10. And it feels like it's got beads in it. I don't know. I got my scissors here to cut it open so that maybe you won't hear as much crinkle or paper or whatever. If you guys want to see a video that's funny, watch Cinnamon Stitches video. But see, what she does is she opens all 12 days in one video. My nose is it. And... I, did, I stopped watching it at day nine because I didn't want to spoil the part surprise. Okay, and there it is. Ooh, I don't know what it is. We're going to pull it out. Oh, what is it? It's done. It is earrings and a necklace. I keep your I keep yarn close to my 
heart. Hmm. So let's see. It's got a resealable here. A resealable. So we can take it out. I thought it was going to be beads and it was going to be all over. But it's not beads. It's a chain. And the earrings have... Yarnologist is what the necklace says. I can pull it down so it looks even here. Okay, so there is the earrings and the necklace. So let's see if I can stop it from moving. I don't know if you guys can read the yarnologist part. But it's pretty cool. Oh, so the chain is at least 16 inches long because it says 16 plus. And then it has some little round things that makes, I guess, think of ball, balls of yarn. And then it has an extender if you need to extend it, I think. I don't know. But anyway, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Yarn balls and then some fake gems. Yeah, they're analogous. I don't really wear jewelry. But that's pretty cool for day 10. Okay, from Hobby Lobby. Now I got a surprise. Santa sack. So let's read them. This is from Lion Brand. Secret stash of yarn by Santa. Lion Brand yarns. An elf packed by Elf 1878. <laughs> North Pole approved. <laughs> okay, what's over here? Something with a reindeer. Air mail service by Santa Claus's reindeer. Very cool. Up here on the top, it says Santa's Toy Factory, North Pole Post Office Service. Okay, you guys. So there's the North Pole Post Office Service. And then down here is the reindeer one I just read. So there's the Santa sack. Now, if you got a Santa sack ordered... And you don't want to see what's inside. Spoiler, spoiler. Ooh. There's supposed to be nine skeins of yarn. Okay, so this is limited edition. Lion brand, limited edition. Number four weight. 100% acrylic. Naturals. So this is a number four, and it's naturals. Neutrals. It's a tan color. So there's three of those. And then here's three more. Let's see. The color on this is gray. So this was neutral, and this is gray. And then, has it in the sack. <laughs> and this is, this is, this is blues. So you got grays, neutrals, and blues. Limited edition. 100% acrylic. Weight number four. Definitely would be nice blanket. I think that's what I'll probably make with it. So this was in the Santa sack. So now you know if you if you want one or not. So that was really cool. And then of course you get the big red bag. And I, <clears throat> what I've been using the big red bags for is to store, uh, of course, large quantity of yarn. Um, I go through that Red Heart Super Saver Aaron Fleck 
for a lot of my projects and I just ordered 10 skeins and perfect same as that you know something like that and then I ordered three um, big skeins of Burnett baby blanket so I don't put multiples of kinds I just put like one project of yarn and then I also have some Ocos that are all one color that I could put in some you know and whatever so so that's the deal so we um finished the square number nine we're going to print out the pattern for square number 10 um we got our yarn for number 10 and some jewelry for number 10 and a santa sack so i hope you guys are having a nice vlogmas enjoying all the people's videos i've been watching i've been i've been watching um crochet creations by christy no Catching Name by Ella, and Crochet A uh, with Sandy, and who else have I been watching? That might be it. You know how it is. We get on here, and our brain just goes, poof, it's gone. And of course, you know, I flipped through Cinnamon Stitches and I, but I had to stop watching Cinnamon Stitches because I didn't want her to give away the, the last three days of surprise. So we have two days left of Hobby Lobby Stitchmas. And I really loved it because Mr. Cinnamon said um, the stuff with Hobby Lobby's name on it, you know, like there was a little stitch marker and there was um, a tote bag uh, keychain thing. That's swag. That's that's um, Hobby Lobby swag. If it's got Hobby Lobby's name on it, so I thought that was cool. So I got some Hobby Wobby, Hobby Wobby, Hobby Lobby swag. Well, anyway, I'm gonna end the video because I'm acting silly now. So I love you guys. See you later. Bye.